Meet Time TV presents Crafty Creations. Here with this week's craft is your host, Taylor Medlin. Hi everyone, I'm Taylor Medlin and today we're going to be learning how to make Christmas cards. So for this craft, all that you're going to need are just your favorite like different kinds of Christmas design papers, maybe some markers, a pen, um, a black marker, a glue stick, some stickers, and some scissors. So one of my favorite things to do for Christmas time is to make a Christmas card for someone or just like friends, family, anyone really, um, because it's really cheap and it's really thoughtful. So as a college student, like most of the time, it's hard to buy things for your friends, um, but you still wanna get them a gift so you can easily just make a Christmas card and it's still really thoughtful. So the first thing that you're gonna do is take one of your papers. I'm using this one. I just think it's cute. So you're gonna fold it in half. Make sure that you fold it evenly. You just wanna make sure that the corners are touching so that the card is not off center. Okay, once you have that perfect, make sure to crease it really well. And then I like to just take like a regular piece of paper, like measure out like how long it should be because I'm gonna cut it so that it's not extra long. You can just like make a little mark and then just cut across the bottom. Make sure you go in a straight line. You don't want it to be crooked. And you can just set the rest of the side. So this is what the card's gonna look like. And it's just like a regular Christmas card. <laughs> All right, so you can set that paper to the side. Then you have your green paper. And in this one, we're gonna be making a pop-up Christmas tree. So it's going to be like the card, and then you open it, and then the Christmas tree. So starting off, you want to fold your paper in half, just like you did with the one before. Again, it's really important to make sure that it goes down the center. And then you're going to fold that back and forth. Depending on what kind of paper you use, it might be more difficult to get it to crease or just like get the size that you want. So just make sure to really work with it. And you have to crease it every single time really well or it's not going to turn out right. So. Just keep going. It's okay if it's not perfect, but you want to get it as close as you can to being even on all sides. And then you're just gonna keep going back and forth until you get it all the way across the entire paper. It's kinda kinda look like a fan whenever it's all done. Almost done. And there you go. So that is what it's supposed to look like at the end of like folding it all up. It's gonna be kind of like just all crinkled up. And you're gonna cut it in different lengths. So the first one is going to be the longest. And then the second all right, so we're just gonna cut these and then after the break, we're gonna finish. Thanks. <laughs> Don't you hate it when it's raining and you've left your rain boots at home? Well, that's not a problem anymore with Stay Dry Shoe Caps. Stay dry shoe caps, you can play in the rain all you want, with no fear of wet socks or squelchy shoes. All 
All right, everyone, welcome back to Crafty Creations. So we're going to be finishing up the Christmas tree. Um, so you're just going to cut the different lengths. So you're going to have the largest one at the bottom. Then it just goes in increments, just smaller and smaller as it keeps going up to the top. And then the smallest one, you can, you don't have to make a really small one at the top, but you can if you want to. So I like the really small one. Um, yeah, so you just get those and then make sure that your card is facing up the right way because you don't want to do it like accidentally upside down or something. Take your glue, start with the largest one and make sure that um, you glue it like either if you want it in the center, glue it there or if you want it like more to the bottom, you can do that. So you're just going to start off by putting the glue down, um, measure out so the glue doesn't go too much past like the size of your paper and then put it there. You're going to just like keep gluing those up the whole way. Put glue on both sides. Make sure that they're not getting like bunched up or anything. All right, this might be the hardest part of the whole thing just because they can start to like kind of get messy and just like not stick very well or something, but it's okay, like just keep going. It's all gonna be fine. <laughs> and then you're gonna want to try to push them down as much as you can whenever you're wanting to like close it up. So I'm actually not going to do that one because I want to write a message at the top. So you have those three. And then you're going to add your glue to that side. You have to make sure that the glue is really well on there or it's not going to stick to your paper. So get that on there. And then try your best to hold them down while you close this. That is definitely the hardest part for sure. So you're just going to hold it for a little while and try to like make sure the glue dries. You don't want it to open up and then not be <laughs> glued the right way. While you're waiting for it to dry, just think of like maybe what you want to write on the inside. Like I know that the outside says Merry Christmas, so you could write something sweet on the inside. And then when you open it up, it's going to be like a little Christmas tree. And so you just got to make sure that everything is all glued down. Okay, so once you have that done, then you can just add on like your own touches that you want. Like you could put like a star at the top or something, um, or you could just like add on like little dots and things for like ornaments or whatever. There we go, <laughs> great star. So if things like this happen, then you can just add more glue and then like it'll all be good. And then you just write your message on there. So that's the first card that you can make. Turns out like that. Looks really cute. And then your second card, you can just make like a really easy, simple one. I'm just going to use this paper. And then I'm going to use stickers for this one. So this one's really easy. Even kids can do it. Or you can just do it like if you're in a bond and you're about to go to a party or something and you just need something real quick. So I just chose the mistletoe paper and then I'm just going to use these stickers that I got. This says Merry Christmas. I'm going to use this one for the front. And then that just like pulls it all together. And then on the inside, you can add whatever you want, but I'm going to use the wreath. And just write, Merry Christmas. All right. Thank you all so much for joining us today. And we hope you enjoyed. Have a great day.